So I'm just gonna do a little bit of filming while I'm on my ride home. Um, yeah, it was, a, it was a great range day. I had a lot of fun today. Uh, I was doing filming primarily for the Glock 43 and the Concealment Express holster that I'm carrying that Glock 43 in. Uh, I've been carrying that Glock 43 for, uh, well, about four months now. And uh, it's time to finally do some video work on it. And, um, and get you... Uh, get you video so now uh, I'll be, uh, be editing that through the the benchtop stuff is actually done already it's just trying to get the range footage in and um, the other thing I was filming today was for the Sylvan Arms uh, folding stock joint for the AR that was um, that was actually a, a surprise purchase um, I was talking to Ghost Tactical one night after a podcast and he was talking about it and, and I've always kind of wanted one um, but it wasn't necessarily the Sylvan Arms one it was uh, another one that was a lot more expensive and the price of those things are is really what kind of kept me from buying one but you know he kind of hit me at a weak moment and while we were talking I ordered one I was on Sylvan Arms and their website and I found a, a cosmetic blemish one so um, there's going to be the Sylvan Arms video coming out sometime soon as well. So watch out for that. And, um, but yeah, it's uh, we have like half day Fridays through summer at my day job. And uh, I played hooky today. Um, I did have a phone call I needed to take while I was going to the range. So I just did that in the car on the way to the range. Um, but, you know, I had way over 40 hours going into Friday. So... Uh, I don't feel too guilty about playing hooky in the afternoon. I don't have any work that's pressing and no one's looking for anything. You know, when I get home, I'll probably do a bunch of emails and just kind of catch up on some work. But, you know, it's, uh, it's one of the advantages of being uh, salaried rather than hourly is that, um, well, I mean, I wouldn't say it's an advantage because I put in over 40 hours and I'm supposed to be doing less than 40 hours because of the half-day Friday, but... You know, if I want to play hooky sometimes, it's, you know, I, I can do that. Um, it's it's not that big of a deal. It's And, you know, with the half-day Fridays, nobody's really looking for anything anyway. But um, I don't know if you guys will be able to see it. We've got about 20 fires going on in Montana. I'll turn this around. And I'm not quite sure if you can see there. That's the, uh, that was the Elkhorn Mountains up ahead. A lot of smoke in the uh, Boulder Valley here. Uh, when I left the Helena Valley, it was uh, it was it was even worse. It's a little less here, but um, but yeah, it's um, it's smoky here, and um, and uh, you know one of the things I really love about living in Montana is our speed limit. Um, we moved here; it was seventy miles an hour. It's now eighty, and um, well, you can set your cruise control at eighty-five, and Highway Patrol really doesn't even bother you. Um, it's funny because um, Highway Patrol is actually moving down here to Boulder. And they shoot, they're starting to shoot at this range that I'm shooting at. Um, I knew, I know a bunch of people were from Highway Patrol shooting there earlier because I picked up a bunch of 357 SIG brass today when I was policing my brass. So, uh, not that I have a 357 SIG, but it's on my bucket list, a, a list of calibers. And um, just collecting brass to eventually load for it. And uh, so for you slow states, that's what uh, life at 85 miles an hour looks like. It's kind of uh, kind of sweet. Uh, you know, we we got long distances to get between cities, so uh, they have they have speed limits. So. Uh, to get us to where we're going. Um, other than that, man, it's, uh, you know, uh, I'm looking forward to the 5,000 subscriber mark. That's coming up soon. Uh, probably sometime in August, I'm thinking. And uh, I'm working on something special for the 5,000 mark. Hopefully, uh, 
Hopefully we get there sooner than later, because I really want to get to this this special. But um, we'll see what happens. But um, anyways, I'm getting ready to go over Boulder Hill here, and I know it's probably loud as anything looking at the voice meter here, but um, when I start going up that hill, that engine's going to start revving up, and uh, you're really not going to hear much. So uh, anyways, so thanks for uh, joining me on a little bit of my ride home from the range. I uh, hope you guys are all staying safe out there, and um, make sure you stay tuned to the channel for some new content.